NCSoft just released their fourth quarter 2022 earnings call, and we got a little bit of information on Throne and Liberty out of it. First of all, they reiterated that it's coming in the first half of the year, and a little bit of information on they're actually looking to implement chat GPT in some of their games. We don't know if that's being implemented in TL necessarily, but I, it would make sense. The main goal of it is to use it for game content production. So for creating stories and set characters is the main thing apparently there. It's really all from this little article. There wasn't much in this article. This article here has a bit more in it. This is a big one. As previously announced, TL will be published directly by NCSoft in Korea and by a partner company in the global market. And once a global publisher is selected, global testing and marketing will be disclosed. So this leads me to believe that they are in fact going to use a different publisher besides themselves and they plan to do global testing once they have a global publisher. So that's uh, interesting news. Now, who knows? There's, this is translated, and this was probably put together at the last minute by some Korean reporter. So <laughs> there's always a chance this is wrong. But this is uh, potentially big information that, out of all this information. And really, that's all I have for this. It is some interesting new information, potentially. I'm working on redoing my Everything Known About Throne and Liberty video because, frankly, it didn't do very well. And I think I can improve the retention and, and improve the quality of it immensely and there is enough new information now that i think it's worth redoing so that's coming pretty soon i'll see you guys in that video if you like the video subscribe and i'll see you in the next one